I want to tell y'all the story of Hayden Rourke. His partner was Justice Addis III. They were together from the late 30s until just died in 1979. How did they do it? <laughs> yeah. In 1940, they are doing Addis and Rourke productions. Just is directing, Hayden is starring, and they're both producing. And then 1942 hits, Just gets drafted to World War II. Oh my God. Hayden is like, cool, I'm enlisting right alongside you. <gasps> They report for duty at the same time, and they're immediately like, you two, you're going to Irving Berlin's Army Musical Program. <laughs> I think Hayden Rourke became a sergeant from just doing musicals. <laughs> I didn't know that was an option, and now I'm rethinking everything, <laughs> yeah. every conversation I've ever had with my brother. <laughs> is there still a musical production wing the Army? <laughs> <laughs> this is the Army, like, so it was written by Irving Berlin. Uh, it opens on Broadway, it runs on Broadway for a year, and then they're like, let's take the show on the road, and they tour internationally. So this is a book that the stage manager wrote. Hayden and Justice were his first Ooh. and second, uh, Stage managers. A stage manager, first of all, just like we need to we need to raise the roof for stage managers. Stage yes. managers, I will follow into the dark. Stage managers are amazing people. <laughs> they make it happen. They Especially literally they make, make it, it happen. happen. Here is a photo of all of the um soldiers getting into drag for a number in This is the Army in World War II. Okay, first of all, there's these dance belts are lovely, or what are these loincloths? What's happening? One of them looks like, like Alaska. They're wearing, yeah, they're yeah. wearing. <laughs> this is crazy. And they're that's from the forties. Yeah, ladies of the chorus. It's ladies of the chorus. Yep. Wow. So then they moved to Studio City in 1955, buy a house together, which is where they will live for the rest of their entire life. Um, they constantly throw parties. Everyone knows they're a couple. Uh, they invite Later. the entire genie cast over all the time. And now I'm just envisioning like 80 gay men in this in this Studio City house and Barbara Eaton and like, you know, with all her hair pieces she would wear in oh, the yeah. 60s. <laughs> and just, like, just like chuckling and like holding some kind of like Mai Tai and all the gays just being like, oh, Barbara, tell another one. Like, how fabulous. 